Hey guys, Thunder E here and welcome to our review of the HyperX Savage SSD. Yes, Savage. Uh, this is the latest SSD from HyperX. It's got a three year warranty and pricing starts at 97 bucks because it goes from 120 all the way to 960 gigabytes in storage. Yes, 960. We have the 240 here. So we decided to swap out the hard drive for our Lenovo T440S, which originally has only 120 gigabyte uh, SSD drive in there. So taking a look at our HyperX uh, Savage here. Pretty nice looking SSD, red, shiny silver, Savage is, is stated on the black part right there. Um, again, nice drive, very slim profile as you would expect from most SSDs anyway. And uh, again, the pricing really is a great factor because your 120 starts at 97, 240 is 147, uh, prices goes up and then 960 is uh, 597 or so. So basically. Um, you've got some really affordable, well-priced SSD prices for the Savage. Now the packaging here with our full kit version, you've got a sticker. Uh, we've also got a portable drive uh, kit so we can actually create a portable um, um, SSD drive here if we choose to or connect it to uh, install into our desktop PC or our laptop. So we have all that gear built in there, which is which is nice that you can get that or at least you can order that whole package. So let's throw that all in and let's go ahead and and install this into our um, uh, T440S here, uh, which we want to see how much kind of speeds we get, the kind of performance we get, we're going to give. Now, the, the one thing about the uh, Savage Realize, I think this is, is replacing the 3X line uh, that we had from Hybex so or from Lee Kingston back in the day, at least that division. And uh, it's, it's a, that used to be a very solid drive. So I can see this also going to basically move things forward uh, to give you something affordable uh, and something that you can actually actually used for some really good performance with 560 megabytes read speeds as well as um, a 530 megabyte write speed. So we'll seal that, but let's go ahead and just throw it in and install it into our system here. So our hard drive is installed. Let's go ahead, and power the system, install Windows, and get things rolling. So everything's installed now, and we're running AS SSD just to give you a quick, simple benchmark test, uh, so you guys know exactly what we're doing here and see what kind of performance you get. Remember, 560 megabytes uh, read speed, write speed is 530. Uh, this is close to 240 uh, gigabyte uh, SSD. And, and what I've what we've been told from Kingston is that the speeds are better between the 240 and the 480 drives um, in comparison to the 120 and I think the 960 is also comparable also so let's take a look at the AS SSD software you can see uh, of course uh, we can check the, for the speed speeds 4k 4k 64 thirds and access time uh, that's our drive there that's actually the model number for the drive there with the sh uh, uh, designation there and let's go ahead and start this up and see how it handles So looking at those numbers, this thing handles pretty well. You know, read speeds are we clocked at 493 and write speeds at 476. That's pretty good. And the overall score is 1,104. So I definitely like what I see here with the Savage. I think this is something a lot of gamers will like who are a little bit cost effective, but want some really good performance. I think you will find it with the HyperX uh, Savage line of SSD. So if you guys have any questions or any comments about the HyperX Savage, let us know. Uh, if you've bought one and installed this, 
just let me know what your uh, kind of performances and what you've been getting overall but i like it so far and the t40 has been working pretty well it's done a very good job so guys uh don't forget to like this video share this video and favorite this video also do subscribe to the channel and uh, this is Thunder Yee saying thank you and always enjoy your entertainment.